Hi friends, this is Shraddha. Welcome to my channel Early Learners and Light Trainers. And today's topic is pretend play. So imagination activity session is going on. The activities that we are discussing in this video is related to the imagination activities, right brain activities. So right brain activities are many and I have listed down in my YouTube channel. Please go and see all of them. The playlist is getting increased and increased day by day. So there is a segment called as imagination activities. So this is my second video on it. So it says pretend play like for example whenever you are going to start imagination activities you have to make your child sit or sleep and tell them to deep breathe and you are going to have a small session of 5 to 10 minutes with them so the child has to be 3 plus or 4 to understand this so these activities are generally for the bigger child and not for the kids that are 0 to 2 or between 2 to 3 but still you can try when the child has just started his second year of life so coming back to the point how you do this activity just sit back relax if the child wants to run let them run you also run with them come back and sit down nicely and tell the child now we are going to peacefully relax and we are going to start a small activity a small session take a deep breath remove all the anxiety that you have in your mind just just let the love flow in your mind now imagine that you have become a doctor now you are going to treat your patients there are so many corona patients and you are going to make them fit and fine now come back now you are going to become a astronaut now you are going to go to the moon and now you are going to go to the mars and there you describe whatever you want to see when i say pretend play it is just like the physical pretend play like we have the doctor set we have the nurse set, we have the kitchen, we have the car set. You have to just make your child sit and you have to ask them to close their eyes and imagine the activities of a professional. Like for example, I'll just show you. So imagine you are telling your child to relax, to sit back and take a deep breath. The breathing should be like four inside, five breathes outside. Make them totally relaxed. Be, do it this activity before you sleep or uh, in the afternoon nap any time of your choice and uh, make the child feel very much relaxed okay i know the toddlers are not that relaxed so make sure that you do it uh, before the bed bedtime or nap time and tell them that today you're going to be a pilot now you're going to see many planes and just make them pretend and play what you play physically just ask them to play here in their mind even if the activity is for one minute, that's okay. But let them imagine a pilot. So to make them imagine a pilot, you can have a flashcard or you can show them like in any way that you are able to. So this is a pilot and just make a story around it. You can make them pretend and play of an engineer. You can make them pretend and play of an entrepreneur. You can make them imagine, ima imagine and play of a sculpture a news reader, a magician, a astronaut, driver, sailor, florist, pathologist, vet, air hostess, surgeon, dentist, artist, librarian, beautician, joker, lawyer, sports person. So, so there is nothing that you know can stop you from creating an imaginary play for your child. So don't stop yourself only to the physical activities. Just make the child relax and ask them to pretend and play in their mind also. Okay guys, once again, thanks a lot for your cooperation and do subscribe to my channel. Pretend and play is an imagination activity of right brain education. It is going to help your child to imagine some things that are def definitely uh, beyond our imagination. They can imagine anything. And after their uh, session is completed, you can ask them, how did you feel? What did you do? And things like that. This doesn't mean that you're test testing the child. This is not a tester testing your uh, stuff. It is just that you are asking your child something out of curiosity. Okay guys, so thanks a lot and bye bye.